Because you know the main thing I noticed about your entire performance is the there was no eye contact with the audience. And to me, that is a very important thing. There are people in the room. You know, it's not uh, in this digital age. I feel like we keep forgetting that you're here to connect with the audience through your music, and that is your sole and only goal. And I felt like that's where you're missing out the most. You had everything technically on. You were singing well, you were playing well. But as a band, like because there are five of you on stage, you had that extra opportunity of being able to focus on your audience as well. Because all of your life, there are five people doing what everybody else was doing by themselves, right? So I felt like from a performance perspective, and this is just from a performance perspective, right? from your arrangements, everything was fine. I just think that from a performance perspective, you had the opportunity of connecting with your audience, which I feel, feel like you're feeling that because it was no eye contact. You're, you're connecting with each other, which is great, right? And it's a very common thing that we find in, in Mumbai bands or bands that perform in Mumbai. Because nobody comes to see us, right? It's, it's, it's like, I, I was performing at Blue Frog, and there were five people in the audience, and what do you do? You have a band to connect with them at that time. Mm -hmm. and, and yeah, the band was like, I remember my first show was at Jazz by the Way, where there were more people in my band than the audience. <laughs> And uh, so what do you do at that time? It's like a free rehearsal, right? You're just there and you're connecting with it. And it becomes like a habit because there are years of this coming. It's like you're sitting there and you're like, you know, on stage like this and you're like, uh, you know, you're just kind of smiling with the band because there's really nothing else to do and you forget there's an audience. So I would say that work on that because that will really change the way I feel your performance. Don't take out the human element of your performance just because you all have a band. You know? And I feel like you guys are all very talented. You did a great job. When you're 70, I can't freaking believe that. And uh, I mean, I wish I wasn't even doing music when I was 70. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> so you guys are great. I, I mean, I know Karan, he's a, he's a great cover player. And there's multiple other percussions as well. If you haven't heard a cover of mine called Hasi, uh, Karan was the one who played uh, Tabla on it. And uh, he was, of course, going all for it. Like Karan usually does. So, uh, no, but it's good to see you again. And you guys did a good job. I hope you <laughs> No uh, godfather in the industry, but I had wonderful people to work with. Those who are here standing. So, one thing you have to remember is that if you have to take something, only take your talent to Mumbai. This city will never be used again. That's my promise. Thank you. Thank you so much. And I think that's all the inspiration all of us budding artists in the when, when industry stalwarts give us that kind of encouragement. Uh, industry Tolbert is also here. <laughs> Arjun Tolbert and Tolbert, please tell us. You know, you, you, like you said, at 70, you won't you won't make music. This is sincere, but you always connect. Just playing guitar to chase girls, man. That's the honest truth. <laughs> the honest truth was I like this girl and she liked music, so that's why I learned to pick up the guitar. But uh, I mean, it got into something serious. Uh, yeah. So yeah. But for not giving up. Bad days. That's not the whole, the whole point is that you're working towards better time. So, all of us have struggled in some way or the other. It's, it's good to not romanticize the struggle. Yeah. And that's what we used to say. Yeah, that's what And uh, the struggle is, it teaches you. It teaches you to be stronger, it teaches you to be better. But that's not the goal. Don't get stuck in the struggle. Don't be like, yeah, ye struggle mein kuch hai. Kuch a better place. So I don't I don't think that I've never looked at it like that. I've never looked at it like I mean struggle kar raha tha, yaar, itne bure din the. At that time it was just it was just how it was, right? You don't think of it like my struggle kar raha bhi. You're thinking of it like I'm doing my thing. You're doing your work, you're doing your, doing your job. Right? In retrospect it's a struggle. Right. Retrospect to work with cheese right? So I, I don't think I, I think that I've been only blessed with, like you said, very nice people, very good people. And uh, I think that I really truly believe that if you have talent you can make it. I have, I bet my career in it, so, <laughs> so it's pretty much, uh, that's what I think. I, I actually want to add, you know, I mean, for all musicians, I genuinely think there's a lot to learn from this guy. I work very closely with him and I work with a lot of other artists. There are two, three things which are very unique about this man, right? One is discipline. He is extremely disciplined. And when I say discipline, it's discipline in all walks of life, including his biggest passion, which is music, right? The, num the number of hours that he spends, uh, to come up with melody is unbelievable. The second is uh, uh, his desire to achieve, uh, to be a perfectionist, right? He does not uh, compromise on anything. And when I say anything, and I that think... Really annoying, though, like, <laughs> it can be, but I think it's one of his biggest assets and it should, it's, it's an asset for anybody because uh, in today's age and world, this is not Bollywood music, right? This is non-film music, this is singer-songwriter, it is his voice, his song, his face on it, right? 
and which means that an artist needs to be involved in every aspect of it and that is one thing you must credit him for right because he gets involved in a tremendous i struggle and we should not do this and all of that trust me uh, one thing that both of them probably have is the great amount of discipline hard work and passion that they have वो बारिशें क्या हो गई क्या हो गई वो बारिशें तुम बेनिशान क्यों हो गए ढूंढू कहा तुम है हजारों आंसू में संभाले बैठा हूँ रुलाने आई है मुझे जाने क्यों यादें भुला हूँ कैसे मैं वो सारी बरसाते गुजारी थी हमने जो साथ में वो बारिशें क्या हो गई क्या हो गई वो बारिशें तुम बेनिशान क्यों हो गए ढूंढू कहाँ तुम्हें